um hello everyone welcome back to a new video my name is vicky for those of you who don't know honestly it has been so long since i filmed a video and also um every february i said i would film a video because i guess that would be like my youtube anniversary or whatever and i have been just posting random stuff on the internet for three years now on this 14th which is tomorrow today it's actually saturday and it's the 13th so i just figured i'd do my um i guess annual um valentine's day video and i asked people on instagram just to ask me questions because it'll be like a life update and like chit chat get ready with me whatever i'm not doing anything <laughs> but um i'm not doing anything really but i just uh what am i saying I just wanted to do my makeup and like I got my box return for this month so I just figured I use some of the stuff from here I'm not really gonna go into depth in depth into the things anymore so I'm um, just gonna use some of the things that I got from my boxy charm and just do like a Valentine's Day makeup and just catch up and just ask questions and just chill just vibe you know and I have like a background situation I bought this like little backdrop thing um, it's about to be like over two years since I bought it since like I first started filming I was like oh I'm gonna have a backdrop or whatever and I never used it so now I'm gonna use it I'm gonna try to incorporate more backdrops into my stuff so yeah let's get started I'm gonna go ahead and do my base um for my base I'm gonna use my let's see I got this um primer that Imaya gave me she always like hooks me up with the best thing she got this for my birthday last year and it's the professional hydrating primer and i'm gonna be using that and the elf camo cc cream this is oh i feel like my skin i have like a little bit of pimples here and there but this makes my skin look so good and i'm just i just apply a little bit of this not just all over since it's hydrating it's good for my skin because i have like oily combo and it helps with my pores which are horrible um but yeah this lcc camel this i love this i'm in the shade medium 330w which is um it's medium warm with olive undertones so if you guys are kind of like my shade this um 330w would work so well and also i recommend getting the brush it's like this it's the of complexion duo and it's <laughs> like um a laundry desi lc say it's bon appetit so i'm just gonna go ahead and do that now we can start with the eyes and blah blah, blah. i'm gonna do my eyebrows and then i'm gonna come back and then we can start just talking about some questions and doing this eye look so i'm just gonna show y'all a little bit of this i don't apply too much because i'm like natural but we apply a little bit a lot because a little bit a lot a good amount today because if y'all were to go out with y'all mans your boo whoever it is um y'all wanna y'all wanna have the whole bang so i'm gonna go ahead and do that like i said and then we shall be right back y'all see that coverage oh beautiful I applied two layers of this and it looks so good so glowy and okay so okay now I did my brows I just used this elf instant lift brow um I like this for like two bucks you can't go wrong and my brows are a little a little dusty but we're gonna move past that so in my boxy charm I got this ace beauty nostalgia nostalgia is that how you say it in english and it is this is 38 dollars. it's 15 color palette and i saw it and these are like i guess like valentine ish colors so i figured i use this also i'm gonna re recreate this look that i saw on pinterest let me show y'all if y'all know who created this like y'all can just let me know I just found it out on um, Pinterest and I thought it was cute like the pink liner and a little bit of like peachy pink in the in the lid so this is what the palette looks like and I feel like 
it was going to be like appropriate, I could use these and I would get a cute little look. Okay, so in the box, I also got this um, little cute Glamour Pink Luxe Glitter Eye Brush Collection and it's so cute. Look, it's four little brushes and look at the hearts. Let me take it off. Look at these hearts. It's definitely the Valentine's Day theme. So it has four brushes. It's like a angle brush, a little packing liner brush, and just some fluffy brushes. So I'm gonna use some of these. Well, it's gonna be like less of makeup and then more okay. less of makeup and more just like keeping up. So like I said, I asked y'all to ask me questions but not a lot of people did so i'm just gonna talk some stuff on my own and just answer the couple of questions that i got so um january was a really mentally exhausting month i guess you would say um i was just out of my element just not really i don't know like i'm i was just like in a really bad space like a whole bunch of stuff happened with my family but i'm not gonna say like everything because it's personal and even if i have my life out here on the internet it's, i'm not gonna exactly say everything that's going on but just like my family was going through it in january so i was just like so out of it and then just like my, my emotions and feelings have been all over the place so i just felt like i wasn't in a good space to film by the way i'm using both of these shimmery this one and this orange one on my lid so i just felt like i wasn't in a good mental space to film and i feel like january still felt like for some reason i don't know why everybody just thought that because we were going into 2021 like things were going to be different but no like covid cases are going up and just not going back to school like on campus like i have online classes like I just missed the whole vibe of like being in school and stuff, but I'm back. I'm coming back now. I'm back and I'm better than ever. I hope I am. And so like yeah, that's I'm hoping I can create a whole bunch more. Like I feel in a better space. I'm definitely feeling better now. So I feel like I can create more. And I have a lot of videos in mind with my friends and stuff. So I hope those can be coming up very soon y'all stay on the lookout for those like make sure you guys subscribe and follow me on instagram i'm gonna leave my little instagram somewhere here on the screen and my socials are always in the description bar just in case you guys are like oh what's her ig or something yeah they're always gonna be in the description bar down below so now i have like a couple of questions here it's not a lot honestly it says what are your plans after college will you be will you still be wearing a mask after covid okay so first of all my plans after college now i'm gonna take this darker pink and try to do a liner um my plans after college honestly i'm still thinking about that because the way my life is set up right now i'm thinking about um changing my major it's so late in the game but i mean it happens i'm thinking about changing my major into like education but like a math math teacher because honestly i help everybody in math well like the younger people in my family and since i tutor um it's just kind of like i guess a passion not a passion how would you say it? um it's something that i've always done you know like i've always helped kids i've always been the one to always been the one person that like all of my little cousins and stuff they come to it's like i'm that person i'm that teacher so i'm thinking about it but if i do not like decide to not change my major um i'm probably going into so i'm right now I go to school for um computer science i'm majoring in computer science and i'm going to do a concentration in cyber security and a lot of places need ah, a lot of places need that like cyber security thing to keep their company safe so hopefully if i can find like a job there i'm going to try to get an internship within this next fall um, honestly, I get so upset on myself because I know I could be done with school right now, but 
I say this to other people and other people tell me this, but I don't, I just feel like I'm not worthy of that advice that I give other people and that I give myself that everybody has their own timeline. Like everybody has their story written and everything happens for a reason. So like I'm exactly where I have to be. And my friends tell me that like don't stress you're exactly where you're supposed to be. So I'm just like okay well I'm, I'm still a little bit sad. Oh, well. So I'm trying to do that. Yeah that's what I'm going to do after college. I'm definitely going to be going into like these companies. These well starting small into a good company where I can just like do what I was going to school for. And will I still be wearing a mask after COVID? Low key, yes, cause I'd be ugly. Nah, but um, I feel like it's it's safer that way. Until there's like absolutely no um more cases, is when I'm gonna be like, okay, I'm not gonna wear a mask anymore because um people be dirty, like people just be sneezing all over. Like imagine that. We used to just be out here and people used to sneeze and they don't even sneeze into their elbows. So it's like we were really out here just living life with no worries. Like people used to be out here sneezing, coughing and all these particles in there. I might, it depends honestly, but I'm, I might just keep wearing a mask. What about y'all? Y'all still wearing a mask after COVID? I feel like it's the safest thing honestly because i just got caught at lol because they keep saying like that there's like a i don't know the words but like another another dose and it's like um mutating and all this stuff so it's like damn we can't just catch a break but yeah i might i'm definitely gonna be wearing a mask until it's like safe to go out in public with no masks and who knows when that's gonna be so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and finish this liner and then I'm gonna come back and just answer these <laughs> next few questions, which isn't a lot really. So, finish the liner and I'll be back. So, I went and cleaned up. <laughs> now I'm just pink. I don't know if y'all can tell. But, yeah, okay, so I really like this. The shadows are very pigmented. I'm for sure gonna have my eyes stained. Um, these brushes are super cute. They're super cute and super soft. I use um this one to pack on not glitter the shimmer to kind of have like a little um how would you say it like dispersed blended look but these are brushes they're super cute they got the little hearts honestly they remind me of, of acrylic brush that i bought and <laughs> it's cute okay so now i'm just gonna use this wet and wild concealer this is in a shade lighter than i usually use this light medium i use the same concealer to clean out my brows but in the shade medium tawny and I want to be bright so that's why I'm using this lighter shade so I'm just gonna apply it because I did remove a good amount of concealer when I was cleaning up the fallout okay so another question that I have was like what's my daily routine and my daily routine from day to day varies but like I guess you would say like the days that I do the most work would be like Tuesdays so on Tuesdays I look I'm gonna try to wake up earlier now but usually I wake up at 9 if I don't wake up at 9 I will get I will wake up at 8 but I wake up between 8 and 9 and I will have breakfast wait okay I will have breakfast and stuff and then I will just catch up and like read emails because when you are an adult you start checking your emails more than your text messages so i check my email and just check anything from school if i have any emails from my professors or just like from school itself and then i go to my messages and check my messages and i'll check my social media see and just catch up and then while that is happening like I'll just mentally prepare myself for class. I have a class at 10. So then I go to my class and my class is from 10, 10 to 10 50, which is pretty much 10 to 11. And then I have a break. So I go and have lunch. And once I have lunch, like I'll start getting ready for class at one. I have class at one. And so I start getting ready before class because right after class, 
my class starts at 1 and ends at 2.15 and I, at 2.45 I tutor. And I tutor virtually so I have my camera on. And I have to have my camera on because if I don't have my camera on, my kids aren't going to have their camera on. So it's more of like I have to set an example. And so I just kind of do like a simple routine. I don't know if you guys would be interested in it. Because I do do like a fast 10 minute makeup routine. And yeah, let me know if you guys want to see like a quick Zoom meeting makeup. But I do that, then I go to class. Like I said, my class lasts from 1 to 2.15. And then I'll have like a little snack. And then start tutoring at night tutor from 2, 2.45 to 4.45. So I do that, and then I go and have uh, go and have lunch, and then in the evenings. Um, recently, I've been helping my cousins do their work, so whatever work that they have, I help them. And then I just try and get like my schedule together. Like I'll do any missing notes if I miss, and just catch up on my notes, and just catch up on my reading for 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 class and stuff. And yeah, and then. I usually don't have a lot of homework right now because it's mostly discussion work that we do so I'll do that usually I just stop doing whatever I like ate and then I just catch up on social media I just catch up on YouTube videos just reading I don't do a lot but I could do a video of like my um, weekly routine because I only do that on, like Tuesdays and Thursdays and then Wednesdays I'll just have one class and then Mondays I'll have class and tutoring and then Fridays are like my off days so yeah maybe if you guys are interested in are interested in like a routine video let me know I will film that I'm almost done with my face oh okay so for like if I want my makeup to last last more and since like Valentine's Day y'all gonna want your makeup to last more um i like to go in with cream products first so i'm gonna do a cream bronzer and i just go like a muffle head because i got a fat full head and then i i go with my nose too i'm trying to learn how to contour my nose because i don't like my nose and i see other people just contour their nose so beautifully but i can't do that because my nose built different you know you know what i'm saying you could go around your lips so you could have like that pout mm -hmm. you're gonna blend it out it's not gonna look like this we're gonna shape shift and just a little bit on the freaking double chin and i just take a brush i take this uh elf elf stippling brush but yeah um honestly that's all my routine really no that's oh yeah so that's it for like my daily routine i don't do much well actually i do do a lot I'm gonna start doing a little bit more now, but that's gonna be like an update for another day maybe. But yeah, so far that's my daily routine. I wish I had like an aesthetic daily routine. Uh, I might, I'm gonna start getting up early so I can like work out. Like my, when I start working out, like it's true they're like oh you release like serotonin and dopamine and all those like happy drugs and stuff so if i wake up early enough to work out every time i work out like i i feel good i feel good about myself i feel good about life you know i just feel good in general so i'm like dang i really do need to start working out so for sure this next week coming up i'm gonna have to make the effort because it's all about what is it uh, if i want to see like results it's all about like consistency and more like discipline like that's always been my problem it's a discipline problem and i don't know what's wrong with me like i know i can do it if i want to but i just get i guess discouraged because i want to see results like this you know and i can see results that fast but I'm just like, I'm just like, I need the results to be a little bit faster, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna get like another SD card so I can do like a whole like weight loss journey video situation because I want to look good in 
I will look good. I want to feel good. When I when I look good, I feel good. And I haven't been doing any of that. So, yeah. I'm going to be working on that. So, it's because, honestly, my mental health has been all over the place. So, yeah. I need to work out, work on myself in order to feel good. And that's, honestly, that's all that I'm missing. Because I, I have a good life. I'm blessed to have a good life. So, I, I can't really complain. You know, I shouldn't be complaining. But I just need to look good so i can feel at my best you know well i'm almost done with my makeup let me set my face and then i can just answer the last question that i have y'all need to ask me some questions because these videos i just be talking about random stuff if y'all don't give me props you know but yeah let me go ahead and just set my face and then i'll be back oh uh, i'm just applying br blush this is the wet and wild mellow wine and i'm applying a lot because i love a good blush i can't even tell but i it actually looks like i have a ton a ton lot on my cheeks but it looks good it looks natural i promise i went ahead and contoured my nose i just used my butter bronzer like i always do because i can't find a good bronzer i'm gonna do brown liner in the waterline okay so i have one more question it's from my bestie ah! she said what zodiac sign messed it up for the rest and when i saw this saw this the first <laughs> my brain i automatically went to gemini by the way i'm using a brown liner i automatically went for gemini <laughs> but i'm a gemini myself so it's like i a gemini me messed it up for the rest but I think it's mainly like men, Gemini, because I've <laughs> because the way it's set up. I think I'm just gonna take a little bit of this like darker wine red because like men, Gemini. Like I've seen like all over social media, people hate them, and I see why because um, I knew somebody. I'm just being so shady. Um, but the possibilities of him coming across this video are low, so I don't care. Um, he was a gem. There was this one guy that I was talking to. He was a Gemini, so um, yeah, I think it's him. Well, I think it's just Gemini and like Gemini men in specific that messed it up for the rest. But yeah, I think it's mostly like Gemini men. Either way, people hate Gemini, so if I hated my own sign. There would be no problem because it's it's only natural it, it it makes sense you know and honestly i've i i don't think i've had like problems with any other signs it's just been gemini's and also i'm trying to think if there's like another sign i don't think so let's see i'm gonna go ahead now and pop some lashes yeah i think that's i wanted to say cancers but I'm, right now I'm just attacking the guys who I talked to and they were just dumb, you know. But yeah, um, let me see who else. Probably just Gemini men for sure. And like, I don't know, for some reason like, when I think of Libras, I think of, I don't know, people I don't like. Well, it's not, I don't even know these people's signs, but I just think of Libras and I'm just like, ew. But I've never came in contact with a Libra. Honestly, I've never came in contact with like a whole bunch of the the signs. I only know like my friends and they're not nobody's like ever like a Pisces or an Aries or nothing. Like my friends are Capricorn, Can and Cancers. Two of but all of my closest friends, two of them are Capricorns, two of them are Cancers. So it's like they need a little bit of me. They need a little bit of that toxic in them. I really I really have a mood for them all. And one of my other friends, he's a blah, 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 I think he's a Scorpio. I don't know, honestly. <laughs> okay, so I applied some lashes. Anyways, um, I applied some lashes. These are just um, these eye only lashes in the style Big Bay. And I trimmed them a little bit off the outer corner because they're a little bit too big. And I got them, guess where? Dollar Tree. Y'all sleep on Dollar Tree. So now let's see. 
Um, I didn't apply highlight. I'm currently not a big fan of highlight. So if you guys want to apply highlight, you're going to apply highlight. But I won't because it's not my it's not my ish right now you know what i'm saying well actually i am gonna apply just a little bit at the tip of my nose and i'll just apply with my finger i like a shiny nose just a little bit i don't really like it on my my cheeks right now i don't know sometimes i think i just like highlighter more on the on the summer days i guess you would say like a nice glowy skin okay so the next thing in my boxy charm was this um it says it's a saint lux beauty limited edition liner and it's 40 dollars for two lip liners and they are so pretty i opened them earlier look at these shades oh, perfect perfect like nude lipsticks um let me swatch them for y'all this is the lighter one i don't know if they have names let me this is the love this is love letter it's the lighter one and the darker one is called secret admirer oh okay so secret admirer is at the bottom oh i messed it up and love letter is at the top focus it won't focus but that's super cute um yesterday i did a lip and it was so cute so i think i'm just gonna repeat that I feel like it would go with like a nice red situation. So what are y'all doing for your Valentine's Day? Let me tell y'all what I'm doing. I'm going to be uploading this video. Oh, okay, so I'm gonna take Secret Admirer, the dark one. But so I can't do this. Hold up. I'm gonna overline a little bit because I don't like my lips. I have small lips. Okay, so for tomorrow I'm going to uh be having a movie date but not with boy uh boys are not allowed in this room um jk but um i actually love this color i'm gonna watch a movie with jenny she's been on my channel before just like last year she was on my <laughs> she was on my chat oh well, a little bit close and personal she, she was on a video my valentine's day video last year we watched a movie we watched to all the boys we loved before p.s i still love you and that was the second movie and this year the third movie came out on the 12th but we were like no we had to watch it on valentine's day since we don't have dates jenny is my yearly valentine and we have to watch this movie if y'all watched the second movie last year, were y'all team Peter or team John? Low key, I was rooting for John because he was so nice and just, ooh. Jordan Fisher, oh, I love him. But honestly, um, I don't know if it's just me, but like, for these to be expensive, like I love the color, but then they're not as creamy. Well, kind of, I don't know. But they're definitely not worth $40. Peter, I love Peter, but not... Peter Kavinsky, but not Noah Centineo, you know? At one point, I thought he was, like, super cute. But then I just kind of, like, I was like, he's not that cute. But, like, Peter K, I love Peter K. If you watched the movie, um, Always and Forever, what do you guys think? I haven't watched it yet, so I can't really tell you how I feel. And I'm gonna add this red pink from ColourPop. It's in the shade, it's an ultra blotted lip. In the shade Doozy, I don't know. But um, if y'all watch the movie, or if y'all will watch, if y'all watch the movie, like let me know what y'all thought about it. I've seen the trailer, and it looks like she has to make a decision between like college or Peter. Honestly, I would never make a decision because of a boy. Like, I mean, well, okay, in high school when you're like dating somebody, you think it that person you're dating that's gonna be like your forever so i can see where she's like having her her like choices second second thoughts right now about whether whether she's going to go to the same college as him or go to another school that she actually likes so i i, I get her like i would I, I think i would be dumb like her too and peter kavinsky i give peter kavinsky my heart um, but honestly, I don't know. I feel like yeah, boys aren't worth it. Honestly, boys are never worth it. Boys are never worth friendships. Boys are never worth schools, careers. None of that. They're they're really not worth it. 
the girl on the video she just had a gloss not the video the picture but i kind of like this like monochromatic situation actually i'm gonna go ahead and add yesterday i added i have like this mini l'oreal sample that i got sent it's like you see how cute that is i think i'm gonna add it this is more like a rosy pink i actually did this lip yesterday as well uh that's those are my valentine's day plans i don't think i'm ever gonna have like a, a guy valentine because boys are annoying and boys suck because this is super cute but yeah that's gonna be my plans let me know down below your plans for valentine's day are you having a galentine's day or like an actual valentine's day if you did did your significant other give you a gift if they didn't throws them to the curb because you deserve better just because you got that person doesn't mean you gotta stop making the effort and honestly i i think about this every year like why does it have to be valentine's day why do you have to wait for valentine's day to tell the people you love them that you love them i tell my friends all the time that i love them sometimes because sometimes i don't have love for anybody i barely have love for myself anyways yeah i think i'm done let me see let me just check you I have any final answers there's questions okay so this is the final look that was created i had more stuff in my boxy charm box like it was this like lip cheek duo but i forgot about it it was like a balm like a creamy situation okay so this is gonna be the end of my look also i forgot to say let me see over the last three years i, I started posting videos three years ago and i'm <sighs> look for the people like my my friends who always support me i'm so thankful for y'all and also for the people who just randomly subscribe if you watch it thanks you're a real one like i always say if you watch it till the end you're a real one and i now reached 300 subscribers in three years so like every year i gain like 100 subscribers and i'm so thankful for them i honestly thought i was gonna stay at 57 subscribers when i first did so that means a lot so everybody who has subscribed thank you so much maybe i should try to do a giveaway i'm gonna do a giveaway when i hit uh 400 right now i am at 331 i'm gonna do like a 25 dollar giveaway because i don't have a lot of money and 25 dollars that that's uh that's a meal right there so i will pay for your meal that's gonna be the giveaway when i hit 400 subscribers so yeah um happy valentine's day stay safe wear your masks um and i will see y'all on the next video bye i hope you guys enjoyed this look so okay why well, i gotta edit this now okay bye for real <laughs>